Shalom and welcome to Lapid Live. I'm Rabbi Mordecai Griffin. So good to be with you in this very short video. I want to give you the vision of Lapid Judaism, how it came to be, and how Hashem brought it to us, so to speak. In the winter of 2014, my wife and I, along with a few friends, went and spent some time in Israel. We were staying in Jerusalem, very near the King David Hotel in an Orthodox neighborhood having a fabulous time, enjoying the wonderment and awe of Israel on yet another fantastic trip. That Shabbat that we were there, we decided to visit the Great Synagogue. My wife and I and our party walked to the synagogue and had a fantastic time. We had a, a beautiful service there that day. But as we were coming back to our apartment to enjoy a little bit of Oneg, we were discussing how it lacked something. As followers of the Messiah, Yeshua, we instinctively knew that it lacked the Messiah, it lacked the spirit of the Mashiach, it lacked, in our opinion, a, a flame, a fire, if you will. And we were discussing with each other, what can we do to bring about a global identity of a authentic Judaism centered on the Messiah? And most importantly, what should we call it? We knew that we were not Messianic Jews. We did not fall into that category. We needed some other type of identity. That afternoon, for Minka, I went down to the Kotel, and I was davening and studying and praying to Hashem. And I came across in my studies the verse in Isaiah, Isaiah 62.1, where it says, For Zion's sake I will not be silent until her righteousness shines brightly and her salvation goes out like a torch. I looked at the word torch in that passage and it's the word lapid. And instantly Hashem spoke to me and said, that's the name. It's the name of Mashiach. The salvation that's going out to God's people is the lapid. I went back to the apartment and I explained to our group there that I felt like Hashem had shown me there in Jerusalem what we were to do. We were to initiate a new movement reality. It's not really a new movement. It's a renewed movement of Yeshua-centered Judaism, an authentic expression of Judaism centered on the reality of Messiah Yeshua. And so we went, came back to the United States. We came back to our congregation here in Fort Worth, Texas, in Sar Shalom, and put together some ideas. And I was further thinking about this entire uh, concept. And in June 8th of 2014, I had a meeting with our volunteer staff at the synagogue, and I expressed to them the concept of Lapid Judaism and the idea that it would be a global movement to bring people back to the original faith of the Messiah Yeshua. So in short, people ask me all the time, what is Lapid Judaism? Why do we need it? And what is it all about? So here is the what of Lapid Judaism. Lapid Judaism is very simply the faith of the Messiah and his apostles and the faith of those who followed their teachings for hundreds of years. It is just very simply what Messiah believed and how he lived his life. Our goal, my goal has always been to bring everyone back to the authentic faith of Messiah Yeshua. As far as why we need it, the why is very simple, because it's what Yeshua did and it's how he lived. Moreover, we live in a time that has been pretty much devoid of any type of authentic expression of Judaism centered on the Messiah. And we have a desire to bring that into reality. I felt that it was necessary to be used of Hashem in any way I could to revive that lost faith. How we do it is by living an orthodox expression of normative Judaism in Messiah. Our faith is not that much different than your traditional orthodox Jewish congregation. We live according to the halakha and we believe in the authority of God's word and the authority of the, whole, of the oral Torah and the validity of the halakha. It's just that we believe that Messiah Yeshua is the Messiah of Israel and our hope and faith and trust is in him, the Lapid, the torch of our salvation. So that's the story of Lapid Judaism. That's how it all began. It began on a street 
in Jerusalem in front of the great synagogue. And I, Rabbi Mordecai Griffin, very humbly had that concept and brought it back. There have been people who have come together and joined us to help make Lapid Judaism what it was. We had a professional designer, for instance, come up with the logo, um, who happened to be a member of our congregation. We had other professionals develop the website and bring that into fruition. And now we have so many beautiful people helping us make these videos and bring this reality to the people. So I'm asking you to join Lapid Judaism. I'm asking you to take hold of the faith of the Messiah of Israel. I'm asking you to be part of the renewal, the part of the resurrection of what the apostles began so many centuries ago. You and I and thousands, perhaps one day millions of others, will take hold of this faith of Lapid Judaism and usher in the coming of the Messiah, maybe soon in our time. Thank you so much for joining me.